Hey guys, in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to do a self fade, at least to say oh hi do a fade, as you guys can see, it's not brushed or comb or anything yet, I'm about to do that, so hope you guys enjoy this video, if you do, please remember to like, share, leave a comment down below, let me know what you guys think. Alright, so these are going to be the tools that I'm about to use, a mirror, a brush, a comb, this to get all the the dust off me the hair sorry and then this is what I'm gonna be using don't worry I'm gonna leave a link down below so you guys could grab one if you do it's like a complete kit I'm loving it so far I've been doing self cuts since um, January 2021 so if you guys are long time viewers you're gonna remember I used to have the puff and stuff so without further ado let's dive right into it all right this is gonna be the, the clipper Hope you guys can see this. This is what it looks like. This is the trimmer. Oh man, it's taking a minute to focus. <laughs> Alright, that's what it looks like. And these are going to be the guards that I'm using. Alright. As you can see, they are color coded. This is why I also like this set because it's so color coded. So I'm going to use the one to four guard. Because I, I don't really have much hair on my head anyway, so without further ado, let's dive right in. Alright, so I just gotta brush it in. Looks good, looks brushed in and everything. Right? I think it's good so far, so take my mirror and look. Yeah, looks way better than before. Definitely looks better than before. All right, without further ado, let's dive right in. Get my clipper. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a guideline between the dark, dark, damn, I don't even, between the dark and the light side. Dark, light, I'm gonna make a guideline about right here. Go all the way around, all right? All right, as you can see, I already started one side. So I'm just gonna show you guys the other side. Hopefully you guys can see because I'm going to be looking at the, the mirror, not the camera, alright? So, because I don't want to mess this shit up. Alright, so what happened is I always use the tip of my eyebrows. So I go like this, da 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 da. I use the tip of my eyebrows. Alright, and then I just start. Then I got to make sure everything is level with the other side. So what I do, what I always do is I also give myself enough room to work because by the end it might be up here like it's my, I, I need this to fade, I need enough room to fade all this in, I need enough room to fade all this in, alright, so I always give myself enough room to work, feel me, so All right, so I just finished making a guideline. I hope, I hope it's okay. Hope you guys are seeing this. Hope you guys are seeing it exactly how I'm seeing it. So that's the guideline right there. So now all I gotta do is I'm just gonna get rid of down here and then I'm just gonna jump right into fading everything. I said before, I always wait like two weeks to come out here. So I don't really have much and it, and it takes me less time. It might take you more, it depends on the height of your hair and where it's at, but I just normally cut it at least every two weeks. All right, because I like to keep it level and fresh. Well, what can I say, you know? All right, this is where shit's gonna get messy, so let's go. Let's start with the back. So first of all, let's start off by saying I like to go upwards. I like to go opposite where my hair grows. Feel me, so I always go opposite. That way I take more off. Feel me, well, I think I take more off. So this way I get it as low as possible, as bald as possible. Well, that's what I believe, so let's continue. The 
first of all, let me say I like to do this in the bathroom. It's easier to clean up right now. I'm in front of my girlfriend's vanity that she just bought. I'm creating such a mess, so you know. This is gonna be a lot of cleaning up. So, plus, oh yeah, plus where our vanity is, it's carpet, so you know. That's also gonna be a major problem, so. Please, please, please. <laughs> like this video man all right so i already got that side yeah i think i got this side so what i like to do i like to go over it over and over again just to make sure it's clean you know smooth and everything so don't be so don't be don't mind when you see me going over it again and again even during the fade and everything i like to make sure it's smooth because i don't got those ball clippers that i see those barbers using i don't i don't got that feel me so let me take care of this side now and i'll be right back okay so as you can see i took that side out give you a quick spin keep doing that <laughs> anyway so i'd go over it over and over again with the trimmer yeah with the trimmer feel me i even turn it this way i know i said this is how i do it to get the air off but like to get it really bald sometimes i gotta go like this all over the bald spot and stuff see just go over like this and then i just go up and do all that i gotta clean feel me so that's pretty much it for the trimmer now it's gonna be time for the clippers so first of all this is the lever fully open okay from now on everything that i'm gonna do for the first layer it's gotta be fully open fully closed fully closed look at it move fully closed fully open okay big difference but as you can see i got a dent here because i keep I always use it halfway like from to blend in the fade and everything well, I'm gonna show you guys what I mean don't worry so fully open oh, man just to be safe let me brush it some more guys all of this is gonna go feel me everything is gonna go nothing is staying here I think yeah I like it I like it like a good good decent low length you're gonna see what I mean at the end um so i gotta I always have my little napkin to clean my mirror off and stuff i gotta keep it clean so i can see everything and i mean everything feel me so all right all right so i'm gonna use i'm gonna start off with the four guard feel me i'm looking for my comb but i don't even know where i put it i found it so I gotta use my comb, feel me, so what I do is I like to lift it up. My hair is dirty, I didn't wash it today. I just jump right into this video. My hair was getting annoying, so I'm just gonna wash it after. So if you see all those dirt <laughs> flaking out, or the flakes, don't worry, I'm gonna wash it and everything, feel me? So get it up, get it ready. All right. Get everything out there, get everything out there. Okay, enough of that. So I'm gonna start off with my four guard. I said before, everything is color coded, all right? This is my four guard. One more thing. When you're knocking out the lines, make sure you use like these, like about, about four or five feet, teeth, feel me? About four or five of these teeth, and you gotta do it. You gotta stop using the camera to see this thing, using the mirror. So you gotta hit it at an angle. It's losing focus, is it? All right, so you gotta hit it at an angle, okay? So hit it at an angle, angle. Feel me, I keep losing focus. Anyway, you get it, you should get the picture. So you hit it at an angle, angle, all the way around, all right? Okay, so what happened was I was using the four guard and I had to switch it out. It wasn't doing anything. My hair is too low for that. So I had to switch for the two. Yeah, for the two guard. Hope you guys can see that. Still not focusing. For the two guard, all right? And as you can see, it starts, because I go all the way up, so it starts knocking out some hair. 
because the four guard wasn't doing anything. I said before, my hair was too low. So I always give it a flick up, go all the way up, flick. All the way up, flick. Come on, flick. Flick, all right, flick. I said before, I'm gonna take more off anyway, so it doesn't matter. So, all the way up, flick. Flick, flick, flick. I don't even gotta look, flick, flick. All right, I gotta look, flick, flick, flick. I ain't do this all the way around. Uh, please tell me you're in focus, all the way around. Okay, so, come on. Tell me you're in focus fam. All right, that looks good. So, all the way around. All the way around, okay? And a rule of thumb, try to use at least about, I think this is like one inch, come on, focus, about one inch. So you can use <laughs> this part of your finger, this, 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 to measure it. But I said before, for me, yeah, that's just about right. One, one and a half. For me, I like to go up, so you're gonna see. This is how I do it anyway. But that's just one way to do it as a beginner, okay? That's what I did. Hear me. We go up, up, up. Yeah, as you can see, I got, I got a good amount out of it. So, all right, so I gotta clean this. But as you guys could see, hopefully. I hope that was in focus, but as you guys can see, I already buffed out this side. So what I like to do next is, I like to get rid of this line. So what I'm gonna do, I'm, I might switch to the one guard, and I'm gonna open, I'm gonna open the lever to about half. See, where, where this is where I got my scuff marker. This is where I mostly use it, to knock this line off. Sometimes, at first I do this, and then I fully close it. And, and that's when I don't use any guard. When I fully close it to get this line out, right? So, all right, let's, let's go into it. All right, so first of all, I gotta say, I had to take the guard off because it wasn't doing as much as I said before. My, my hair is lower than usual, you feel me? So, I literally just started cutting it every two weeks. All right, so what happened is I took the guard off. So now I, I'm just leaving lever open, half close and fully close okay so this is just my transition to get the line out the fade the line to, to create the, the entire fade the guide the guideline this line so i had to get it like this like oh you see it on this side i mean i had to do this off camera because it's come on man i'm trying to look at the the, the mirror see what i'm doing and at the same time I'm trying to make sure you guys are seeing so i had to knock this side out because this side is harder to see and um, if I try to knock it out on the camera, so I just got rid of this side first So I'm gonna show you guys how, how I did it, how I did this side and this side Don't worry, there's gonna still be more work done, but I said before I'm just trying to show you guys how to get rid of this line right here How to create the fade, feel me, so I'm just looking how to create that fade effect You see this line, how it's, how it's pronounced? It's, this line is pretty obvious, right? It's pronounced unlike over here all right so let's 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 go into that lever all the way open and then i just go up create this loop on the line i do about half a inch for the beginning so i'm trying to get rid of this line feel me I hope the camera is in focus, man. All right, so that's that. 
brush it in. As you can see, it's still there, right? So I'm over again. Lever all the way open, slightly to an angle, and I'm going up. Trying to knock the line out, okay? Key. Key is to get rid of that guideline. Alright, so I'm sweating, so I got it. I got the fan on and the AC on. I'm still, I'm still sweating. Yeah, I got those shit on. Alright, so. Now I'm going half. Half close, okay? So let's go. So now I'm just tackling the line. Oh man, I hope this. This is so hard to get in focus, man. I'm just attacking the line. All right, brush. Sweat off, man. It's ridiculous. So I'm going again. Halfway close or halfway open. Doesn't matter what you want to look at it. Put it in focus. All right, now, fully closed. All right, so I gotta push it back in. And let's see. As you can see, the line is now fading away. All right, so I'm going back in because I might have to take a little more off here. Just a little bit more. I'm going back in halfway. That should be just about here. Yeah, that should be good. That should be good. Should be just about right. All right, so I hope you guys can see it as well as oh, I can. Hope it's in focus. I can't really tell, but as you guys can see, that's how I do the fade. Okay. That's how I'll be fading it. All right, so that's how I'll be, well, that's how I'll be knocking out that guideline. That way it's not that harsh. It's more faded in, you feel me? All right, so I'm just gonna do the entire round. I don't wanna bore you guys, but you get the gist. You do that same thing all the way around. First I go, first I go, oh, come on, focus. Open, halfway open, all the way close. Feel me? So that's how I'll be blending it in. All right? So I'm gonna do all the way around and I'll be right back. All right, guys? All right, so I did all the way around. Hopefully it's in focus and you guys can see that. So that's me just doing all the way around. Faded, all right? So that's how I do a fade. Hopefully it works out and it helps you guys. But that's how I do a fade, all right guys? So, 
hopefully, I said before, I can't say it explicit enough. Hopefully, help you guys, but that's how I do a fade. I remember I was scared in the beginning to do it myself, but I mean, trial and error, man, trial and error. But this is where I'm at now. I think I could do better, but that's just how I do the fade. I mean, it's not done because I still gotta take the rest off. So, you know what? Enough chit chat. I mean, this video is just to show you guys how to do the fade all the way around. Hopefully, you guys get the gist. And as I said before, I can't stress it anymore. I hope this helps you guys. I'm not a professional, by the way, by any means. Um, I'm just a regular dude, just like you who's watching this video. And you just want to do your own fade and stuff. You know, you ain't got the change or whatnot. Any any reason you have, it's your reason. Feel me? I just don't want to go to any barbershop right now. I just rather do it myself. And um, all right, guys. So enough chit chat. I hope you guys like this video. If you did. Stay tuned for the rest so you can see the finished result.